According to the Centers for Disease Control, 250,000 people are HIV positive, but they don't know it. Alyssa Rossome explains why testing is important. A home tattoo party changed Cheyenne Hale's life. And there was um, some drinking going on and some marijuana use, and um, I didn't see any other drugs, so I thought it was okay. And um, I just, I got the tattoo and didn't think nothing about it. Until a few months later, when she donated blood and tested positive for HIV. It was uh, a shock to me because I thought he had done everything right. Hale says initially it was hard telling her family and friends, but now she's not afraid to share her story. I don't hide the fact that I have HIV. I don't go around telling everybody, but I don't hide the fact, you know, uh, that you need to be tested. It's very important. HIV educator Laquita Marshall says people should get tested every year, especially those who've engaged in risky behavior like unprotected sex or IV drug use. HIV is not a death sentence. Um, there are people, a lot of people, who are living full lives, they're working, they're, you know, in relationships. So, you know, it's not something that, you know, once you find out you have HIV, you know, life just stops. It doesn't stop. And the earlier that it's detected, the earlier, the better chance of it, you know, being treatable. After her diagnosis, Hale was put on medicine. She takes one pill a night. She says her life has changed, but hasn't been put on hold. She's getting married in a couple of months and plans to use protection so her new husband will remain HIV negative. Alyssa Rossame, News Channel 18. Saturday is National HIV Testing Day, an event with free testing and information will be held from 10 to 2 at the Center for Mental Health Office in Lafayette. To schedule an appointment for a free test, call 742-4402.